So on the outside, Agvile Andrew Akaite, the Lithuanian. On our inside, Katarina Glorenko. Then the very good British runner, Georgina Adams, second fastest in the heats with 23.66. Just two tenths behind her best. Zoe Sedney, younger sister of the bemedalled Dutch sprinter Noemi Sedney. Lucy Farage, another heat winner. Chiara Jehadadi of Italy on her inside. Gal Cadmon got through as a fastest non automatic qualifier, as did this woman, the Polish sprinter Alessia Potasnik. So we're looking at lanes three, four, five, and six. That's Haradi, Farage, Sedney, and Adam. Expect the automatic qualifiers to come through from them. It wouldn't be the first time that there's been a surprise. Oh. Adam, somewhat unfairly overshadowed by the exploits of Amy Hunt. But the Briton in lane six, a very fine sprinter. Starts are taking quite a while. Second semi final of the women's 200 meters. And Adam is indeed away quickly. So too Farage in lane four. So it's Adam, Sedney, and Farage. Also running extremely well on the outside, the Lithuanian, Adria Kaiti. And Farage coming through. Well. That's Farage of Belgium, Adam, and a big surprise on the outside, getting a place in the final, Adria Kaite. Well, had a poor heat run, but Andrea Kaite running close to her personal best. Zoe Sedney, just have to wait and see whether she gets through as a non-automatic qualifier. But Farage, good start. Ran a great bend and held her form down the home straight. Well, a poor run in the heat meant Adria Kaite on the outside proceeded into the eighth lane. She was unsighted until probably about 50 metres from the line when she might have had a sense of the women on her inside. Just looking at the times, Kadari and Akinimika from the first semi final will go through as non automatic time qualifiers. So Sedney squeezed out. There's confirmation of the times and the automatic qualifiers. Padaj, Adam, and Adria Kaite, the women who go through to the final. The final will come up at 7.20 local time this evening.